Well, last year certainly had its fair share of memorable moments. Let us hope for the same, perhaps better this time round. Well, what are we waiting for, Peter? Let's get the show on the road. This competition brings a special sense of occasion because of its history and tradition. And I guess we feel privileged to have worked on it over the years and remembering some of the, the great moments. And I sincerely hope we're in for uh, more starting right now. So off we go then. Oh, that's nice. Played into the middle. Well, that's where he wants it. Jagoev. It's come loose. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. And it's played forward. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And now the breakaway. Well, try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Hoists it forward. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern, and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. Tries to get it forward quickly. Vlasic. Precious little by way of goal mouth action yet. Vlasic. Going for goal! Oh, great save, real class. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. He's picked him out. Danger averted for now. And it's Jagoev. Forward it goes. Livakovic catches it safely. And the whistle goes for half-time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, they look lost for ideas and, and lacking in talent, which all contributes to a, a chronic case of impotence. Dinamo Zagreb head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Neither team any further forward than they were when they started out. And we are already promptly back on the way. So deadlock still as the second half begins. Plays it out to the flank. Vlasic is there and he can get that clear. It's on a... has a pop! Oh, that's...
that's a fine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. They've played it short. And the shot! A real chance and a real let-off. Still a, a cracking effort. Really looked like a man on a mission the way he went through on goal. Magnussen plays it over to the other flank. Almost an hour gone. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection on what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Gets it back. Vlasic. Just brushed off the ball there. Deftly done. Oh, good interception. Hoists it forward. CSKA Moscow merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Tries to get it forward quickly. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. One final crack at it now. Vlasic. CSKA Moscow don't have many options and time is running out. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Chance! And the whistle goes, so nearly a telling finale, but it ends nil-nil. Dinamo Zagreb must wait for their first win, but they have their first point. That, for now, will have to suffice. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? I don't think they'll be too upset about that. One point is OK, and steering clear of an opening loss keeps the mood in...